and we're back. Seeing as we've only got one chance to make a first impression, let's go for the ballsy one. My name is Bella Tartine. I shot down your ship. What? Why? We are an unarmed deep space vessel on a peaceful mission. Uh... Who are you? And why have you been kidnapping girls with this ship? Are you insane? Where is the big mom computer that controls this ship? Mom computer? What, what are you talking about? Uh... The wolf told me about you. Okay, now just calm down. You, you need some help. You are not in space. Look at that window. Well, not anymore. You shot us down. No, you were never in space. It's all fake. The stars are on the inside. On the outside, you're a monster. But... She's right, my friend. There he is. That's the wolf I was talking about. That voice. Hey, why aren't you trapped under that junk anymore? I am no wolf, am I, Hope? I'm an old friend. <gasps> Marikai, what are you doing here? I'm here to finish Operation Dandelion for you. I'm sorry that we had to keep some aspects of the mission secret from you and your family. But... how are you... You said our world was dying. It was, but then you went forth and found our salvation. As so many have before you. The Mogs. Sorry about the outer space theatrics. Just a precaution to save you from the temptation to go native as some of your predecessors did. We were never in space? <laughs> no. Laruna is a great empire unto itself, but is part of this very same planet. Beyond the Plague Dam. Funny you should mention that, Bella. Because here we are. Oh dear. Now while I prepare the ship for sterilization, you two sit tight and relax. And know that you are contributing to the well-being of many generations to come. Captain! Up here! I'm a weapon! Uh... Spoon! Hey, look! Oh, a the fork! fork. I'd have a full set if I could just find the... Oh, I wouldn't bring up the S-P-O-O-N if I were you. <gasps> Tiny here broke his heart, so he volunteered for a suicide mission. You shut your mouth, Dutch! Hey, don't worry. I won't tell him who you dumped him for. Yikes. Okay. Hey there. Hope? Bella, was it? Sorry I lied about being your son. The wolf said, well, I'm just sorry. It's okay. I don't blame you. Sounds like Marikai has been fooling all of us for a long time. So, I'm getting the feeling that you weren't behind all these kidnappings. What kidnappings? This ship. On the outside, it's built to look like a monster. <gasps> Every 14 years, a ship like yours comes to a village like mine, and we offer sacrificial maidens to it, so it won't destroy the town. It can't be. And then the monster, your ship, takes some of the maidens away forever. This all sounds so crazy. But it sounds exactly like the kind of scheme the Thrush would come up with. How can we get out of here? I locked the door manually before, but now I imagine Marikai's locked it himself. Our only hope is if there are systems he's overlooked. I'm going to find a way out of here. Okay, I'm gonna try to think of a way too. Has anyone ever told you your hair looks like a gigantic ball of yarn, Mom? This is a sweet picture. Yeah, it helps me remember. He wasn't always a teenager. Any ideas yet? No. Oh. 
Sorry. That's just her. I'm going to find a way out of here. Okay, I'm gonna try to think of a way too. What's this? Oh, that's just my central control sphere. I used it to keep a watch on the ship. Make little changes here and there. Mind if I try it? Sure, but I'm sure Marikai shut down most of the remote features by now. <laughs> hey, I can see the outside of our door. Looks like the controls have been sabotaged. Really? Oh, if I could just get out there, I'll bet I could fix them. Well, yeah, but if we could get out there, we wouldn't need... Yeah, yeah, I know. But still. Huh. Oh! I guess that sparking panel had its power shut off for a reason. Whoops. Ooh! I think I can lock and unlock doors. Yeah, but something tells me not ours somehow. Oh, that's the close. This door won't open. Marikai intends for us to stay put, it seems. Are there any stupid places we can jump? Marikai? Yes? Oh. You lied to me. She's not a computer. I never said she was a computer. She's not behind the kidnappings. You are. I never said she was behind the kidnappings. You weren't trapped under that junk. I never... Well... Okay, you got me on that one. I could be a little overdramatic about physical pain. Why did you shut me into this room? You just shot down our ship, and therefore had to be incapacitated. You're a dangerous girl, Velo. Something tells me we don't even know yet how much. Where are you taking us? And why? To the Red Hangar. For processing. Processing? As in, like, paperwork? Uh... Are the girls you kidnapped really still on board? Or did you lie about that, too? They're all on board and secured in a safe room. Including you. Is there really a plague on this side of the dam? <laughs> yes, there is a plague, but not in Lerona. The plague is you, and your kind. No offense. Our people are the noble result of thousands of years of rigorous and expensive genetic curation. We built the dam to keep out the genetic plague of the Badlands. Badlands? Again, no offense. If we're a plague, why did you kidnap so many of us? Although it pains me to admit it, you spawns of chaos have something that we lost along the way and have not been able to simulate. Something unnameable and primitive. Maybe even brutish, but essential to our survival. What is it? Maybe you don't understand what unnameable means? Uh-huh. That boy, her son, what's his part in this? Shay was raised outside of the nurturing atmosphere of Laruna so that he would be, some would say, weak enough, but I would add sensitive enough to select the subjects who fill the holes, as it were, in our collective family tree. This just gets creepier and creepier. Not everyone has the stomach for perfection. We want out of this room. Trust me, it's safer with you in there. How are we safer in here? Oh, I'm sorry. I meant safer to me. I gotta go. Yes, relax and enjoy. Well. Back to with this. See other rooms. Yeah, but probably only the ones Marikai doesn't care about. Hey, cheer up. 
That's better. So what happens when that ticks down? This is just silly. Oh, it's like, okay. Anyone in here? Unlocked. That's some bad wiring there. Someone should really fix that. Let's try this. Anything interesting going on in here? Cheer up! Unlocked. Unlocked. Turn that frown upside down. That's my gal. Happy ship. <laughs> How does this thing work? Uh-oh. Made it pretty dark over there. Look on the bright side. Let's try this. much stuff to fiddle with. Nothing in here except a hexagal. That's a bad one. Unlocked. Okay, she's on it. Cheer up. Let's move this. Let's put the lights a lot. Empty. Wow, those arms are strong. <laughs> yes, pick that up. Thank you. And now, wait, what are you doing? Oh, I guess it was dirty, but I didn't really need you to. Hey, where are you going with that? Those things have a mind of their own. Hey, cheer up. Everything's going to be... Sorry. Uh, uh. Okay. Kind of bad for that one. Yep, those controls are pretty fried. All right, we've got this now. Hold on. Is that a box of cereal? Hey, 
hold that open for me, would ya? Rats. Huh. Let's try this. an interesting interface to view the ship through. <laughs> Someone should really fix that. We'll find out where that Why didn't I leave that where it was? Locked. Unlocked. Hey, I think we need a safety light over here. How does this thing work? Uh oh. Made it pretty dark over there. should really fix that. She'll have that fixed in no time. Well, just a little bit more. That's a bad wiring there. There she goes. Over here. Hey, I think we need a safety light over here. Ooh, sparky. Someone should... Okay, that should take a little while for her to fix. Just a little bit more. Don't fix that too quickly now. Oh dear. That's a good know. girl. I don't know what to do, sir. Oops. <laughs> Unlocked. Okay, she's on it. Come on. Clearly going to be some kind of timing puzzle. Isn't it? Turn that clown upside down. If there's anything else I can interact with. Any ideas yet? No. Sorry. How can we get out of here? I locked the door manually before, but now and I am going to find a way. What we've seen before. Mirakai? Yes. Oh, that's just... I gotta go. Yeah. Do you guys work together well? Like dynamite and a match. Please. Uh, I'm not seeing... It's so back in the bathroom. <laughs> Something I'm missing. We had something moving about, and now it's gone. Good. 
Worth a shot. That's some bad wiring there. Lock. Unlocked. See? <laughs> Safety light over here. Good girl. That's a good girl. This way. Uh, now we're getting somewhere. Hey, anyone got a flashlight? At long last, we are finally getting somewhere. Someone should really fix that. Okay, that should take a little while for her to fix. That's a good Hey, I think ah. we need a safety light over here. Timed it wrong. But I'm finally getting the idea. Ooh, sparky. Okay, she's on it. Over here. Hey. Ah, got not a flashlight? Fixed. Still timing it wrong. Someone should really fix that. Okay, that should take a little while for her to fix. That's a good girl. That's a bad wiring there. Don't fix that too quickly now. Let's try this. Really fix that. Okay, she's on it. How does this thing work? Uh oh, made it pretty dark over there. Huh. We are now making progress. Hey, I think we need a safety light over here. Okay, that should take a little while for her to fix. This way. That's some bad wiring. Don't fix that too quickly now. Come on. Finally getting somewhere. <laughs> She'll have that fixed in no time. She's just the most helpful little hex of person. Come on. Problems just as quickly as well as I cause them. That's some bad wiring. Don't fix that too quickly now. That's a good girl. <laughs> Look at her go. Fixing problems just as quickly as well as I cause them. Good girl. Let's turn this on. Ooh, spark. A little farther. This could okay, be going better. She's but... on it. Come on. Here you go. Okay, that should take a little while for her to fix. A little farther. Room. Yes, we made it. Home stretch. Ah, no, no, no. Oh. Little girl, I'm so sorry. Dang it. Did you end up in here? Oh, hey, there you are. I'm so happy to see you. You hang in there, girl. Look on the bright side. Uh, OK, 
Okay, here's a hand. Grab it. Yes. Good job. Whew. That would explain why that's there. A little farther. Okay. Let's be careful this time. I hope that hole is blocked up enough now. Okay, she's on it. Yep. Hey, look. An electrical problem to fix. That's right. Better get on that. That's my girl. Check it out, Hope. You did it. We're free. Attention, approaching red hangar. Oh, dear. Prepare for sterilization. Oh, no. chips. What is this place? This is where they build and store ships like ours. The Mog Factory? I'm afraid so. No. This is great. Instead of killing one Mog, we can destroy all the Mogs forever. Oh. And all the people in the factory, too. Darn. There are no people in the factory. It's all automated, but I really... Great! Now we just have to figure out how to use that death ray. Death ray? Yeah, you're right. A death ray isn't going to cut it this time. <laughs> We're gonna need something bigger. Like a bomb. The only thing I've ever blown up was my family's oven. But with all the high-tech stuff on this ship, there must be something we can make a massive explosion with, right? Maybe, but I... So, I'll make a bomb. Figure out a way to dump it in the factory, and also a way for you and me to get the heck out of here and back to our families. Sound good? Not really, but if there's a chance it will get me back to my family, then it's the only option I've got. Not exactly a battle cry, but I'll take it. Well, with actually having reached an organic stopping point, I think we will do just that for now. I'll see you all next time on Let's Play Broken Age. Later, everyone.